Welcome to Safe and Secure Retirement Television. My name is Cynthia DeFazio. I'm joined, joined today by Jordan Flowers. He is Retirement Planning Specialist at Wealth Financial Services and Tax Advisory. Jordan, how are you today? I'm doing fantastic. So nice to be with you this morning. It's so nice to be with you as well. And I know that you've been quite busy because obviously we're talking a lot today about the importance of planning for retirement. And in your opinion, Jordan, how many people fail to plan for retirement as they're approaching the retirement years? Well, a lot of people think retirement is going to be great, but they don't have a plan. Mm. And I think the most important part about retirement is having a plan, a written plan, so they know how they can really have a successful retirement. Sure, that makes sense. Because we've talked in the past about a lot of people will run to their mailbox and they grab out those statements mm -hmm. and they say, okay, I have a plan. Right there is my plan in front of me. <laughs> but that's not the same as a plan, right? Having a statement is totally different. Correct. A lot of people have a 401k here. They got Social Security, maybe they have a pension or they got other investments, but it's just all over the place and they don't know how it all works together to really benefit them and their families. Mm -hmm. You know, I use this uh, kind of illustration, you know, many people plan for dinner and it lasts an hour. Yeah. Some people plan for a wedding that lasts a day or others will plan weeks for just that one week of vacation. Your mm. retirement is the longest vacation you will ever take. That's why you got to plan for it. You need a written plan to make sure it's the best vacation, the best retirement possible. That makes perfect sense. And I love how you say that because that is true. A lot of people spend all of this time planning for that perfect vacation. But so often, <laughs> those retirement years, they go on and on and on. Are you yeah. finding that people are retiring earlier than in years past? I, I, for my clients, I want them to retire earlier. With this whole pandemic, we realize how fragile life really is. And if people can retire early and enjoy their, I call it their go-go years, because they're yeah. able to do a lot, they're healthy, uh, then they go to their slow-go years, and then they go to their no-go years. And I try to make sure my clients can retire earlier and they're not subject to the market or many different factors that may delay their retirement. Mm. So I'm trying to have my clients retire earlier, but uh, with the market in these days, it depends in each situation. Absolutely. And I should ask you, Jordan, how do people know that they're ready to retire? Well, they need to have a written plan and mm. they need to have confidence in that plan. And like we discussed, it doesn't mean you have a statement here or investment here, but what we really try to do for our clients is create a process. We call that process our safe and secure retirement roadmap. Mm. And we go through this with our clients to make sure that all aspects of their financial plan are covered. And it takes time and it's comprehensive, but we literally have a roadmap that we give to our clients and we go through it and to make sure that they have a safe and secure retirement. So yeah. one of those steps, I'll just go over the first step, is your retirement income planning. Okay. Because the game kind of changes after you know you stop working and those wages don't come in anymore. You gotta take income from your maybe Social Security or maybe your pension or your other investments. So we wanna make sure we have an income plan so people don't stop with their lifestyle. Because just because mm. your check stops coming in, doesn't mean that you shouldn't start living or keep on living. And in your early stages of retirement, I think you should have even more income because you're healthy and you should be doing a lot of things and enjoying life to the fullest. So mm -hmm. income planning is so important for many people. And I love how you just stated that because so often people think about entering their retirement years and they're thinking about obviously their spending plan, if you will, otherwise mm -hmm. known as a budget. You never want to see people just get by. Mm -hmm. You want them to enjoy their retirement years. So yeah. you put a plan in place to help them do exactly that, correct, Jordan? Correct. And, and I, budget, it's a, it's a good word, but it's not my favorite word. I call yeah. it lifestyle funds because you have you know your property taxes, your, your maybe mortgage or different fixed expenses. But for my clients, I create a separate category and it's your lifestyle is what do you like to do is it going boating on the weekends or maybe every day of the week is it traveling is it a hobby is it gardening whatever that lifestyle is I want to make sure that you do that and if it's in the plan and you can afford it there's no reason why you shouldn't spend money doing the things that you love to do 
Absolutely. Let's talk a little bit about what it feels like when someone comes into the office to meet with you for the very first time. What can they expect? Well, our staff is very warm and friendly. We try to have a great culture in our office that really is compassionate and caring for clients. So you'll be greeted by one of our uh, friendly staff members. When we sit down and meet for the first time, it's really just a, a way, I call it kind of like a first date. It's mm -hmm. a way to get to know each other. I'm going to ask you lots of questions. I want you to bring in questions. I want to know about your goals, what you're trying trying to accomplish. How many children do you have? Do you have children, grandchildren? What do you like to do for fun? And see how we can, by knowing you better, see if we can create a financial plan, a safe and secure retirement roadmap to accomplish your goals. But it's really no obligation. It's fun. We get to know things about each other and hopefully begin a friendship and a uh, business relationship. Mm. Jordan, I should ask you, what are some common questions that you hear when people come in for the first time? Uh, a lot of questions are, hey, Jordan, you know, when's the best time to take Social Security? Or, hey, Jordan, what, the market's been up. Is this a good time to sell? Should I sell now? I can't afford to take a market, you know, loss right now. Mm. Or some people say, you know, how can you guarantee that I can never run out of money? And those questions are very common, and we really try to answer those questions as part of our safe and secure retirement process. Um, a lot of people, you know, the biggest thing I think a lot of people are facing today is, is taking too much risk. Yeah. I think uh, with the last few months in the market in the last year or so, you know, a lot of people are, are sitting up tall because yeah. their portfolio is looking good and they think they're in a good place. But we know the market isn't something we want to rely 100% on for our retirement. So we have in our safe and secure retirement roadmap process, we have what's called a risk analysis, which includes investment analysis, but it really shows people how much risk you're taking today, because you can't know where you're going until you know where you are now. That makes sense. And then we show them, hey, in the next you know, few years, how can we adjust your risk profile to make sure you're not subject to the next market correction? Yeah. And there's, there's a story that I just love to tell. It hits home to me every time I tell it. I love to tell it to you, Cynthia, about a risk and seeing if you're taking too much risk. Yeah. Um, it's a story of a couple that's going to a resort destination in Arizona mm. and they pass a sign and it says a hundred miles to the next gas station and the husband and wife they look at each other like well we have 125 miles left in the gas gauge should we stop for gas and us husbands we say nah we can push through right we can do that we can make it and the wife's like ah, I think we should stop well they keep on going they see another sign it says 50 miles to the next gas station they look at their gas gauge, 70 miles left empty. The wife is like, I told you so, we should have stopped. But the husband's <laughs> like, we're going to get there. They pass another sign, 20 miles left to empty. And they look at their gas gauge, 25 miles left. We're almost there. They pull in to that resort destination. They check in with the front desk. And the girl at the front desk says, wasn't that the most amazing drive of your life? It was rated top 10 in National Geographic. What did you guys think of that drive? And the husband and wife look at each other and they're like, we were so focused on the gas gauge, yeah. we didn't look out the window. We didn't enjoy the drive. And when it comes to retirement, if you're always looking at your 401k statement or always checking the markets or thinking, can I retire next year? Can I retire in a couple years? And the market's going to dictate that, you're probably taking too much risk. Mm. So we want to show people how you don't have to stress. Yeah. When, when the pandemic happened and the market was down 30% for a lot of people, our clients didn't lose sleep at night. They didn't worry about it because we took the appropriate risk and we created a plan mm. and the market volatility actually enhanced our plans because we knew what we were going to do. So making sure you're not looking at that gas gauge and focusing on the drive or enjoying life, I think it is valuable because we have enough stress in life. Absolutely. Your retirement should not be that stressful. Jordan, I couldn't agree more. This is the perfect time for us to open up the phone lines. Do you want to tell the viewers at home what they can expect to receive by being one of your callers? Sure. Many people have common questions like, when's the best time to take Social Security? Or, Jordan, how can I avoid a market loss? Or, Jordan, how can you guarantee me that I can never run out of money? Mm. Well, our safe and secure retirement roadmap process will ensure that you don't have to worry about those things and so much more. Your retirement is not out of your control. It's not up to chance. It's not up to circumstances. Your retirement is fully in your control by the decisions you make and the plans that you choose to implement. By joining us in our process, whether you have $500,000, a million dollars, or $5 million, we can ensure you will have a safe and secure retirement. But if you're serious about your retirement, you need to take action. Mm -hmm. Please pick up the phone and call 866 
499-3454, and I look forward to helping you soon. Jordan, thank you so much to the viewers at home. The phone lines are now open. That number to call is 866-499-3454. And again, what you're calling in for today is the opportunity to have the retirement roadmap drawn out for you. Again, don't miss the opportunity to call. We have to take a very short commercial break, but when we come back, we're going to have so much more about how to plan your safe and secure retirement. Please stay tuned. Hi, I'm Jordan Flowers. I've been with the Wealth Financial Services and Tax Advisor for over 15 years. I grew up in the Chicagoland area and I've lived here ever since. As a fiduciary firm, we take a personal interest in making sure that you are taken care of. How do we do this for our clients? Well, we create for you a personalized retirement income plan so you see exactly where you're at, where you're going, and how we can get you there more effectively. I will show you your safe and secure retirement roadmap, an income plan to maximize your income, but also minimize your taxes. And we'll talk about what we may recommend and see if you're comfortable with the risk we're proposing. Depending on what your needs and your goals are and how simple or complex you would like me to go over the plan, I will curtail it to you personally. Some people like to go into the details and I'm happy to do that. Some people just want to know that they're going to be okay. My goal is to make sure you have a safe and secure retirement and whether we want to go into more details or less details, I want to make sure you're comfortable with whatever decision and whatever plan we implement. If you're focusing on your investments every single day, you're not enjoying the longest vacation of your life. Make sure that your risk is in line with what your goals are. When someone becomes a client of our we take that very seriously and we look forward to working with them and their family for generations to come. Welcome back to Safe and Secure Retirement Television. My name is Cynthia DeFazio, and I'm joined today by Jordan Flowers. He is Retirement Planning Specialist at Wealth Financial Services and Tax Advisory. Jordan, a great show that we're having today, and again, talking about that paramount piece of having a good retirement plan in place to be safe and secure, which, of course, brings peace of mind. Absolutely. So we talked a little bit in the first segment about the importance of having a plan. So mm -hmm. I should ask you a question because I've heard this study was brought up once before that people's number one fear would be running out of money during retirement. Is that still what you're hearing the most? It is actually true. A lot of people fear running out of money more than even death. Wow. And I think that's, uh, you shouldn't have that fear. Life is too short to worry about running out of money. You should enjoy your life. So uh, yeah. that's a real fear, but we try to take that fear away because when we create a plan for our clients, they're not going to worry about running out of money. They know they have guaranteed income. They have a safe and secure retirement, so those fears wash away. Absolutely. Well, Jordan, you could have chosen to specialize in anything. Mm -hmm. So why do you have a passion for specializing in helping people retire comfortably? Uh, well, I'm going to go back a few years, okay? Before I had gray hair, maybe 20-some years ago, um, my father I was actually, I was with my father at a funeral. Okay. And uh, I saw a woman across the, uh, the funeral room walk across the room with tears in her eyes, and she gave my father they're a big bear hug. And at the time, my father then walked over to me and said something to me, put his hand on my shoulder and said something that's going to change my life to where I am today. He says, son, people don't always want to know how much you know, but they want to know that you care. Yeah. And, it's true. and those words really resonated with me at a young man. And even though I didn't know what I wanted to be when I grew up, I did know I cared about people and I wanted to help them because that gives you peace inside as well. Sure. And, and growing up uh, with my parents, I learned many lessons. Uh, one lesson was at the age of uh, 16 when some of my uh, friends were given uh, their first vehicle. Not my parents. They sold me <laughs> an old Lincoln Town Car. Can you believe that? And then they charged me interest on that, <laughs> a great rate of 10%. And, and at the time, I I didn't like it, but I loved that it taught me a lesson on interest and debt now. Yeah. But because of those lessons, I don't have any debt today. So seeing my father really help his clients and really uh, and benefit them and celebrate their retirements, I had a passion for it. So out of school, I started working with my father. Mm. And I've only had one job in my career, and I will only have one job in my life, but it all roots from caring for people. 
If you put people in the right place and you benefit them and you see the, what their joy is and them enjoying their retirement and, and being safe and secure, it gives inner peace to me. We, we have a whole wall in our office of thank you notes. And when you're mm -hmm. down, you have long days, a 12 hour work day, yeah. you just go over that wall and you say, you read the, the notes and that just gives you kind of a, a boost and it really fulfills why I'm in this business and here to help people and show people that we care and we want to put them in the best place possible. Okay. So when people are coming into the office, they're meeting with you. They're not meeting with anyone else. You're the face that they get to see. Correct. We have a whole team around me, a lot of support staff. But I think when you're risking your entire retirement yeah. Yeah. and you're talking about your retirement, you got to work with somebody that you're comfortable with and a firm that you're comfortable with. So I take those first appointments very seriously. I want to really know people, know if we're a good fit to even do business together mm -hmm. and see if we can get to know each other. But those appointments are with me. I want to take a personal interest. And the one thing I'm very proud of, I like all my clients. Yeah. Okay, I love my clients. We don't like to work with people that are unhappy, right? We like right. people that are happy and they enjoy life. And because I enjoy life, I, I want to talk to my clients about their travels and experiences. But really having that intimate relationship that we really know them well mm -hmm. helps us put a plan together, but it also makes me enjoy my job. Sure. I have a passion for helping people. And that phone rings, I'm not like, oh, John's calling. I'm like, John, how are you doing? Did, yeah. did you enjoy your trip? You know, things like that really uh, bring joy to my life and, and have a passion for really helping my clients. Well, and I think it's so important, Jordan. It obviously sets you apart from so many others because you take the time to care about that person. So let's talk about that for just a moment. The plan that you put in place, it's not a one-size-fits-all. It's going to be customizable to that person's needs. And then Correct. also, does it adjust if people's circumstances would happen to adjust? Correct. Each person is so unique and different. Uh, we're not a, a kind of a cookie-cut office where, hey, if you're at this number, we should recommend this product or do this kind of plan. Each person is so different in what their goals are. Do you want to leave money to your children? Do you want to leave money to a charity? Do you want more guaranteed income in retirement? Do you want to be more aggressive? Um, how does your wife feel about being more aggressive? You yeah. know, how does the husband feel? Make sure that we're all on the same page to create the plan because each plan is so unique and different. That's, I think, why I love my job, too. Yeah. I don't do the same thing every day. I don't meet the same people every day. Yeah. I, I get a variety of different people and different plans, and every day I try to learn something new, which really kind of makes my job enjoyable. So it's, it's not cookie cut. We want to make sure we take a personal interest and customize each plan to each individual. That makes perfect sense. Jordan, in your opinion, if someone is in the viewing audience and they haven't heard from their advisor for over a year, is that a red flag? Uh, it can be, right? Okay. You know, when you have an advisor, they're guiding for your whole financial future. Mm -hmm. And when I, I say this, when we kind of mentioned a little bit ago about first date, yeah. well, when I work with somebody and we decide to be a client of theirs, I say we marry each other financially speaking. Yeah. Because we're usually handling all their investments. We have a tax practice in our office. I can talk about our, our process a little bit more in tax planning. Okay. Um, but we do tax preparation. We do tax planning. So I see them every year around the you know, tax time, March or April. Um, we do estate planning. So we see them if we need to review their trust or different things once every couple years or so. Uh, we do their investments. So we have annual reviews. So when we marry them, financially speaking, being a one-stop shop, we see our clients multiple times throughout the year. Mm. And right now, you know, going back to taxes, things are changing. And, and we want to yeah. make sure our clients are ahead of those changes and preparing for those changes so when the changes occur, they're not going to get left in the dark. So mm. we take that comprehensive approach. Absolutely. And Jordan, we're going to go ahead and open up the phone lines in just a few moments, but I wanted to ask you a very, very quick question. Are you seeing a lot of people come in right now with concerns about taxes? A, a lot of people, yeah. you know, and we're actually bringing up that concern to our clients right now because we have national debt, okay? We have, you know, the stimulus, mm -hmm. and that money, even though it was, you know, tax-free, mm -hmm. we're all going to pay for that at some point. Sure. I, I don't care, you know, politics aside, anyone that was elected, taxes have to yeah. go up. Our yeah. current uh, tax structure in 2025, it's over. In 2026, taxes are going higher. And they mm -hmm. could go higher even sooner. So if you're not preparing now, 
you're gonna get blindsided and what you thought was yours, a good portion could go to the IRS. And I think more and more people are coming to realize that, that taxes are gonna go up yeah. and they gotta take change today. But change and taking action is tough. Sure. You know, change is not fun, but we gotta make sure that we make a change and pay the least amount of taxes over people's lifetime. That's what I always tell my clients. It's not about paying the least amount of taxes this year. It's about paying the least amount of taxes over your lifetime. Lifetime. So that, sure. that's a key point that I like to show people because when I do their taxes and I tell them maybe we have to pay more now this year so we pay less in the future, I'm the one delivering that tax return. So, you know, right. you know they gotta, we got to make sure we prepare for that. But I'm the bad guy come tax time sometimes, but I'm going to be the great guy in five or ten years when tax laws change. Absolutely. Well, Jordan, this is the perfect time for us to reopen the phone lines to the viewers at home. Do you want to tell them what they can expect to receive by calling in? Sure. Many people are concerned about running out of money in retirement. So some people are worried, you know, when am I going to take Social Security? What if my spouse passes away? Other people are worried about what happens when the next market correction occurs. By using our safe and secure retirement process, we will answer all those questions and so much more. To, to, whether you have $500,000, a $1 million, or $5 million, we can create a safe and secure retirement process to ensure your family's in good shape. Your retirement is not out of your control. It's not up to chance. It's not up to circumstances. You have control over your retirement. So I encourage you, if you're serious about your retirement, please take action. Pick up the phone and call 866-499-3454. Jordan, thank you so much. To the viewers at home, the phone number is on your screen to call. That number is 866-499-3454. We have to take a very short commercial break, but don't go anywhere. When we come back, we're going to have so much more. So please stay tuned. How confident are you in your current financial plan? Do you know with certainty how the recent market volatility will affect your future hopes and dreams? How much are you paying in taxes? And how much are you losing to unnecessary high fees? You didn't work to save this money so that you could spend your time worried in retirement. Now is the time to take charge of your finances so you can feel confident about your future. Call in during the next 30 minutes of today's show only to set up an absolutely complimentary, no obligation, full-blown financial review that will result in your own customized written plan. This is a $999 value that we're giving away complimentary to the first 10 people who respond. We'll start with a full-blown analysis of what you already have. By running a report to untangle how much you are currently paying in fees, how you're allocated for risk, and what it's costing to work with your current advisor. Next, we'll identify your goals. Where do you see yourself in the next five years? Where do you want to go, and who do you hope to go there with? Is your current financial plan set up to get you there without mishap? Let's design a roadmap to create a financial plan you can follow with confidence. Get the piece that so many people are missing from their retirement. Find out how having a written plan can make a difference to your retirement dreams. Call now to schedule your complimentary, no obligation, full-blown financial review today. And welcome back to Safe and Secure Retirement Television. My name is Cynthia DeFazio. I'm joined today by Jordan Flowers. He's Retirement Planning Specialist at Wealth Financial Services and Tax Advisory. Jordan, I have to ask you a question. Let's talk a little bit about the confidence that your clients have in their plans. Where does that confidence come from? How do you deliver that? Well, we like to stress test all of our plans. And, and I'm the kind of guy that wants a plan for worst case scenarios and then overperform. So all of the plans that we create for our clients in encompass a lot of things that could happen worst case because I can't control the market, my clients can't control the market. So we want to show that, hey, if there's a market correction of 20, 30, 40 percent, and if it happens maybe every five or 10 years, is that going to derail your retirement? Mm -hmm. And we make sure that they have a solid plan, that that's not going to derail their retirement. Now, a lot of people, you may have heard of sequence of return risk, and a lot of people sometimes have so much money in the market, and if the market falls and then they're forced to sell, and they repeat that process, they could run out of money. Mm -hmm. So by us stress testing our plans, we ensure that's not going to happen. And then another big factor that I think a lot of people have to, like we talked about in the previous segment, they have to talk about taxes. Okay, sure. What if tax rates double? Mm -hmm. What if the estate tax goes down to $7 million or even lower? 
Okay, how are you planning for these things to make sure that your family is going to be okay? You know, even though it's not fun to talk about, but if you have a, I have a husband and wife in the office, I say, hey, worst case scenario, what if you lose a spouse? Okay, how is that going to affect the pension? Yeah. Is there survivor benefits on that pension? Do you have a life insurance policy to go to your spouse so she just gets some tax-free income to keep her afloat from that Social Security that she lost? Mm -hmm. We want to make sure that they're prepared for the worst-case scenario. And what a lot of people don't realize till a year after someone passes away, a spouse passes, mm -hmm. is your tax bracket doubles. You go oh. from a married tax status yeah. to a single tax status. Wow. Your income drops roughly by 40%. Your tax rates double. It's kind of a double whammy, but are you going to be okay? Yeah. Well, having both spouses in the room and talking about these is crucial because sometimes there's one spouse and he takes the lead or she takes the lead in the family, but when I go over a plan, I need both spouses there. Makes sense. They, they need to know they're both going to be covered. They need to understand the plan at a high level. I try to keep things very simple because I think majority of people, they don't want to know every little detail. Sure. They want to make sure that they have a safe and secure retirement. And that's mm -hmm. what our roadmap process does. It's just like a car. You know, when you have a car, you don't want to know every detail how it works. You want it to drive you from A to B. Sure. And I want to make sure my clients get to their retirement and enjoy their retirement. And we do all the heavy lifting, but we want to give our clients peace of mind. And I'm sure a lot of people can appreciate that because so often we've talked in the past by not hearing from their advisor regularly. They don't know what's going on or they wake up and they're surprised. All of a sudden there's a change that they didn't foresee coming. Mm -hmm. You're able to help avoid surprises like that because what you do is basically design the plan that can weather any storm, correct, Jordan? Absolutely, and actually we have a plan for worst case scenarios. You know, Just to give you a more recently, the pandemic, we have plans for our clients to do Roth conversions mm -hmm. and do different tax planning strategies. And when the market's down like it was in March and April of 2020, that was not a time to call your know, clients and say, it's okay, hang in there, okay, yeah. write it out, it's only a paper loss. No, that's a time to take action. That's a yeah. time to do maybe Roth conversions on a lower value and then ride that wave tax-free on the way up or to make sure that we don't have to sell at a loss by having a good plan with not all your money at risk. Yeah. So we diversify and make sure we're prepared for any situation. Mm. Jordan, we have about a minute and a half left of the show this week. What final words of advice would you like to share with the viewers at home? So for you at home that are watching, you might have a lot of questions, and I look forward to answering those. It could be about Social Security. It could be about pensions. It could be about life insurance or never running out of money. Our safe and secure retirement process will answer all of your questions. It will cover everything and so much more. Mm -hmm. You just have to take action and call 866-499-3454. And if you're serious, I look forward to sitting down with you and helping you and building a relationship for now and for generations to come. And Jordan, that consultation typically takes how long? One hour or less. Okay. One hour or less. It's not going to take more than that. We ask that you bring in statements so we have more financial information to help you. Kind of like a doctor, they can't just prescribe something until exactly. they take your vitals, right? So we ask for those you know, tax return, investment statements, so we can take your financial vitals and make sure that that appointment is as beneficial as possible. And we've talked about the husband and wife actually coming in together. That's important as well. It's huge. I want both sides, husband and wife, both to be confident in their plan and know where the money is at and know if something, someone passes away, a loved one passes away, they know who to go to and where to go to to make sure that you make wise financial decisions. That makes perfect sense. Jordan, thank you for another Thanks amazing for show me. this week. To the viewers at home, most importantly, thank you for spending time with us again this week. That number to call is 866-499-3454. If you have any questions about how to retire comfortably and with confidence, Jordan has the answers for you. Again, thank you for watching. Be safe, be happy, be blessed. We'll see you back again next week.